We are currently witnessing an evolution of the human race. I know, I went there real quick, didn't I? Just like the printing press had significant effects on how humans live and do business, the internet and digital media have had an enormous impact on our society. It's an impact we cannot yet fully understand because this evolution is still happening. Right now, there's a generation that lived and grew up without the internet. There's also a generation that hasn't lived a day without it. And this is where the problem lies. The digital divide used to focus on the have and the have nots those who had access to the internet and those who didn't. And while that's still a problem for people in developing countries, 88% of Americans have access to the internet. So now the digital divide is between people who understand how to interpret digital media and those who don't, those who create digital media and those who just consume it. I originally set out to do social media marketing for small businesses and nonprofits. And while there was no shortage of organizations that needed my help, I recognized a much larger issue that no one seemed to be doing anything about. What about the kids? It might seem like kids and teens have a better understanding on how to use social media because they're on it more than adults. And yes, they do understand how to use the different social media platforms. But what they don't understand is the social in social media. Social media is socializing. It's interacting, connecting, and communicating, all of which are essential skills for building relationships, not just with your friends, but with their future business partners and coworkers, or even future significant others. For kids, they can't just pay someone to figure it out. This is gonna be their world. So the best way to prepare the next generation of leaders, innovators, entrepreneurs, and workforce is to help them learn how to utilize and interpret digital media, starting now. And the best way to truly understand media is to shift from being a media consumer to a media creator. That's what I set my new focus to be. But then, while I do have a particular passion for youth development, narrowing my focus to educate and empower only youth is perpetuating the digital divide. Adults, especially older adults, are just as lost if not more lost. If you watching this, likely an adult, don't make an effort to educate yourself on how to navigate digital media, the way I see it honestly, you risk losing your voice. Ideas, thoughts, discussions, money, votes, credibility, all of these things are being funneled through the internet right now. Fast forward 10 years, you can't just stop participating in society because you never figured all of this out. Digital literacy should be a core competency of any citizen of this planet, honestly, regardless of your age, race, culture, industry, because digital technology is something that affects all of us, not just how we do business, but how we learn, explore, collaborate, research, connect, make decisions, execute decisions. It's how we live. We're never ever going back to a world without internet. It's just not going to happen, period. So we can sit here and talk about how sad it is that all of us can't put our phones down, or we can embrace technology and figure out how we can use it to achieve meaningful goals. This is ShareSpark. ShareSpark is an online movement to help people harness the power of digital media to achieve meaningful goals. Via existing new media, a website, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, etc., ShareSpark will, one, educate the basics of digital media, tutorials, how-to videos, guides, news, trends, blog posts, etc. Two, empower. The shift from pushing you to be a content consumer to a content creator. This is the best way to understand concepts like personal branding, online reputation, protecting your personal info, internet security, the social and social media, etc. And three, engage. The true power of the internet and digital media lies in the simple concept of sharing. Information is powerful and content is king, as they say. But no one cares if you can make a perfect video. The real game is when you upload your video to YouTube for all of the world to see. So what do I need? Well, there's a lot of things I want, but really, I have everything I need. So why the GoFundMe? Your like, your comment, your share, your view, and your click. All of these things support media companies and their goal to make money through your social media channels right now. Your donation to ShareSpark is buy-in. Do you believe that this is an important issue? Do you believe that something should be done about it? Do you believe that this would be a positive contribution to society? If you do, please donate. Any amount will help. Literally, I don't even have a mic, as you can tell. But I'm making do. ShareSpark is a movement, and it wouldn't be a movement without followers. This isn't about me. I'm already on the other side. Visit the website, sign up for the newsletter, and please like, share, comment, watch, post, participate in the ShareSpark movement. ShareSpark, share your story, spark your potential.